Welcome to our Android development tutorial. Today, we're addressing a question that many new developers encounter. Our viewer wants to know how to customize the Google sign-in button in their Android app. They currently have a basic layout using the default code, but they're not satisfied with its appearance. They wonder if it's possible to change the button's text and background color or if they should create a completely custom button layout instead. Let's dive into this topic and explore the options available. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you get through that resolution. So, let's continue on. To customize the Google sign-in button in Android, we first need to understand that the default button has limited customization options. You can change the size and color, but not the text directly. If you want to change the button text, or apply a custom background color, the best approach is to create your own custom button layout. This gives you full control over the appearance. To create a custom button, you can use a standard button view in your XML layout. Here's an example of how to define it. After defining your custom button in XML, you can handle the sign-in logic in your activity. Make sure to set up the Google sign-in options correctly. In summary, while you cannot directly customize the default Google sign-in button text or background, creating a custom button layout allows you to achieve the desired look and functionality. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Customizing the Google Sign-In button in Android is straightforward. Start by adding a button in your layout. You can customize the button, but remember to follow Google's branding guidelines. For a custom solution, consider using the library for social buttons or create your own layout with images. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To customize the Google Sign-In button in Android, you should do it programmatically rather than through XML. You can iterate through the button's children to find the text view and modify its properties. Alternatively, you can directly access the first child of the Sign-In button, but this method is less secure. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To customize the Google Sign-In button in Android, you can modify its frame layout. Start by adding a custom background in your XML layout. Inside the frame layout, you can redesign the text view. Use a function to change the button text and style. Happy coding. For a visual reference, check out the results linked below.
Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To customize the Google Sign In button in Android, you don't need any additional libraries. Start by creating a custom layout and place the Google Sign In button within it. Set the button's width and height to match parent, then set its visibility to zero. Next, implement an on-click listener for the Google Sign In button. When clicked, it will trigger your custom layout's touch effect and start the sign-in process. Finally, don't forget to implement a touch ripple effect for your custom layout. You can customize the ripple color in your drawable resource. And that's it. I hope it's helped find you to that resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please just take a moment, go down, hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.